Good morning, everybody. Uh, it's not quite two days or so, just under a day uh, since I did the epoxy on the uh, latex. I'm going to uh, give it a test, feeling it so it's hard enough for me to, to I think, achieve what we need to know. Um, so again, uh, this side had the release agent, this side didn't have the release agent of the uh, castor oil and alcohol. Um, it's, it's hard. Um, it's, it's still like sort of a sticky tacky feel to it or so but it's not uh it's not soft by any means so let's start with the uh with the one with the release agent to see how it comes out of the uh latex i'll hold it up here hopefully you should be able to get a better idea um you get the edge of it here with the release agent it's coming off leaving no no damage to the uh to the uh latex even the thin films are peeling off nice and easily um and then we'll go to the other side and figure out where it's gone to now. There he is. And this side has got no release agent. And again, oh, this is peeling off exactly the same way. Yeah, no release agent needed. Now the next question is, is does longevity cause harm to the uh, to the latex? That I don't know, because that's, that's something that would take months and or years to, to be able to tell whether it's going to age the latex in any way. So resulting pieces, uh, obviously air bubbles and stuff like that because I didn't care about any of that kind of stuff. Um, it's still it's still soft enough that I can apply it's kind of like rubber it comes back to center. <laughs> That's kind of actually a funny feel to it. Um, the uh, detail pickup in it is 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 tr unbelievable. Like even the the creases in the latex are showing on this. I don't know if that'll ever show up on the camera, but. Uh, it picks up detail like you wouldn't believe. Um, I could see this being used very well on on uh, drop molds, on flat work, small flat works. People doing uh, uh, making a mold and wanting to make colorful Christmas decorations or something like that, and pouring it into the latex and peeling it off. I could see this working very, very well with epoxy, um, with a clear resin at least. I'll leave these for a. Like I said, another day or two and see how, how much harder they get. Um, I've never actually peeled any of it out to see what it uh, what it does like this. But anyways, uh, there's a start to the big journey for uh, for everybody. Anyways, thanks for uh, thanks for visiting. Take care.